people that attend business networking events are very friendly. They're there because they want to meet new people. They're there to help. They're there to share their knowledge. I think it really is important as an entrepreneur or as an aspiring entrepreneur um, to take some time to ask questions. You know, it can be a little bit intimidating to admit vulnerability and to, you know, express that there's something that you don't know, but um, asking a question is, you know, the very first step, obviously, to getting an answer. We all have these amazing ideas, but we don't really do anything about it. So I kind of made a promise to myself saying that once I come to Canada, once I start my MBA, whether or not that idea is going to be amazing, really out of the box, whether or not it's going to solve like huge problems, I'm just going to take the risk, jump into the water, and then I learn how to swim. And so the more you are also putting yourself out there, uh, the better it will be with you because you can make uh, new friends, you can make uh, new connections, maybe business partners, you can share resources. If you have been able to come to here, the opportunities are endless. It comes first from you that how do you want to basically market the idea that you have. I would say that Raising money is an adventure, to be honest. Direct sales, you know, face-to-face -face conversations with people is a great way of marketing your product or your service. Word of mouth, I mean, it has been around forever and you shouldn't forget that that's there. Something I definitely encourage everyone to do is to check out our small business tour. Um, so this is a workshop that we do every third Saturday. It's totally free, open to everyone. Money is never a problem. It's never something that stops you. Without spending money, you can still also market yourself uh, and get where you want to go. If you have an idea, put it down on paper. Start crunching numbers, because that's one of the most important things. Start crunching numbers and see if it's viable or not. You know, you need to support your decisions with facts and you need to have a plan. Otherwise, uh, if you don't have a purpose, uh, basically you are not going anywhere. You're not on the driving seat. From wherever you come, I assure you, you have excellent ideas and try to capitalize on that.